pleasant good Wednesday morning it's the second day of March we're gonna have one more day of this warm weather it's gonna be in the lower 80s today uh, it was in the lower 80s yesterday I think it got up to like 81 82 it should be more of the same today but tomorrow is when the weather really changes so we go from an offshore flow to an onshore flow and that's when the breeze comes in from the sea, the ocean breeze. The Santa Ana winds are the winds that come from the desert. That's what brings all the warm air out here to uh, LA. But usually Santa Ana winds bring dry humidity and the onshore breezes bring in humidity. And uh, yes, it's gonna be cooler tomorrow and Friday and the weekend it's gonna feel like winter again but yes we're gonna have chilly nights again not quite record levels though but I do miss the warm weather in the in the morning well that won't happen till April or May when the days get longer and uh, also um, Dallas held on and won 109-104 as they handled the Lakers their third straight loss and Luka Doncic was on again last night. He's uh, up for MVP consideration. Yeah, Dallas is the fifth seed right now still in the Western Conference. And Boston just keeps winning. They, they beat the Hawks last night, 107-98. But yeah, the Lakers were down by 15 at halftime. They trailed as much as by as 21. They they put up a fight though at the end, but even yeah, well we're 0 and 3 since the break, and without Anthony Davis, it's cause for concern, and there's no timetable on Kendrick Nunn to come back this year either. Yeah, that bone bruise was really bothering him. Well, maybe the Lakers should go to the hospital, you know, or. Go, go to go to the ER that's where they need to be in in the emergency room I'm sure they'll be there during the off season I'm sure because their 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 vacations gonna start earlier than expected and we don't know if Vogel's gonna be back but he is signed through next season but I would keep Frank Vogel for at least one more year and um, well the Timberwolves beat the Warriors last night and the Raptors beat the Nets last night, too. And, oh, yeah, and the Clippers beat the Rockets again. Yeah, the Clippers are going in the right direction without PG and Kawhi. Yeah. I don't really follow the Clippers that much, but they're still in the eighth seed right now. So that means the Clippers will likely go to the play-in as well. Lakers, they'll probably limp into the play-in tournament. But yeah, Golden State is in, in, in danger of falling to the to the three seed as well. Yeah, I mean, without Draymond Green and James Wiseman and, of course, Andre I Iguodala, who was likely in the twilight of his career, and he probably has about one year left, I'm sure, but... I mean, once you hit your late 30s, you know, you're, you're, you're toward the end. Also, um, well, unfortunately, baseball's delayed. There's still no agreement signed. And we don't know when this nightmare is going to end, but I guess we'll have to start the season in May. Or possibly June, you know, when the weather heats up. But that means we're going to have extended spring training. And yes, it looks like spring training is going to start in April or May because we need to get our players conditioned. And Rob Manfred is nothing but a stupid idiot. And um, well, also the Heat play the Bucks today as well, and the Suns will play the Trailblazers, and the Knicks play the Sixers tonight. So there are a few big games tonight as well. But the Lakers have the toughest remaining schedule for the rest of the season. 
even if we play 500, we're, we're still going to finish under 500. And we'll probably go to the playing tournament, but we're going to be huge underdogs. Well, a happy birthday going out to Method Man. And of course, to Terry Steinbach and to Ron Gant. And to Larry Carlton. Oh, and a happy birthday to the late Bill Nylinger as well. And uh, he would have been 86. Um, and a happy early birthday to Tone Loke as well. Well, this is nothing but disaster for the Lakers, it looks like. And baseball is going to be delayed. And we all know that America's pastime has gone down the drain. Well... Have a good rest of your Wednesday. I'll talk to you later. Amen.